So something happened to Gemma last night. Actually, two things happened to you yesterday. Do you want to tell us what's new about you? Yes. Okay, where do you want to start? I don't know. Well, do you want to start with this? whatever this is? What happened to you? Um, I, w I was playing at the park with Gwen, and then I fell, and then I had to go to the doctor. Yeah, so last night... Gemma had a little tumble at the park, and just to be safe, we took her to the ER and get an x-ray, and her arm is broken. It looked pretty bad, and so she's seeing a specialist on Monday um, to get it looked at and put a cast on it. Yeah. But she's never broken a bone before, have you? No. No. We've all broken bones. Well, Gemma never has. She was with you at the park. So she guys were playing tag, right? And then yes. she, and she, she fell. fell. She yeah. fell like this. And she also ripped a hole in her pants. When she That's died. okay. We can replace the pants. We can't replace Gemma. Um, and then what else is new about you? What are you? What am I looking at on your face right now? I got glasses. Gemma got glasses. So she failed uh, her eye test at the pediatrician this year. She just went for her checkup, and then we went to the eye doctor and picked out these cute little glasses you want to show them are they purple i think right on the sides yeah yeah she picked these out special she's gonna get a backup pair too but these are just the first ones that came in and do you like them yes you got to pick them yourself yeah so it's been a pretty eventful weekend uh gemma and Gracelyn and gwen all got new glasses yesterday and then immediately after when they went to the park that's when Gemma got hurt and then spent the night or afternoon and evening most of it at the emergency room she does have a follow-up appointment uh, to see the orthopedist so they're gonna check it out and cast it and then let us know like how long they think the healing time is gonna be um, but aside from that she's doing really well it doesn't really hurt right really bad right like you're okay yeah yeah it's just more of an inconvenience because which one which hand do you draw with and right yeah, and you're in first grade now, so having your dominant hand casted is kind of difficult. It happened to me when I was a kid too, and it's like literally the worst. Um, so today we actually planned, before all this happened, uh, that we were planning to go take the kids to this fun event in our town. It's like a big trunk or treat, and I think we're still going to go. I think that's still the plan because Gemma's actually doing amazing, and she says she feels all right. Um, and we wanted to do a costume reveal for you guys in the vlog because I realized that we hadn't done that yet And I'm really excited. I love our costumes this year so much. We've been working on them since Gosh, like July because Gracelyn and I came up with the idea while we were in Tahoe still, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so it's been like what July or August Yeah, and then also I don't know if you guys noticed but we do have a Christmas tree up already Although we have it kind of here. Let me show you we kind of have it decorated for Halloween um, <laughs> so it's kind of giving nightmare before Christmas and then usually the day after Halloween. So this upcoming weekend, we switch all the decor from Halloween to Christmas. So that's going to be happening this week. So check back for that. Um, but I think this actually turned out pretty cool because I just put like all these little black picks and flowers in it, um, from Hobby Lobby. What do you think? Do you like it? Yeah. Mom. What? I was wondering how am I going to, um, hold my basket with this hand and then if it's a bowl, I have to try and... I have to try and like um get get candy. Oh, at the trunk or treat later? Yeah. We'll help you. Okay. Do you think we're not gonna help you? I just hope your little bandage cast thing fits inside your costume. We'll have to try it on. After lunch, okay? I'm starting it right now. Okay. So for lunch today, I'm actually making one of the kids' favorites, uh, breakfast sandwiches. Uh, they'll eat them any time of day, dinner, breakfast, lunch. Um, <laughs> these are breadsticks left over from pasta night last night. Um, but uh, this is like one of my favorite things to make because everybody likes it and it's super easy. These are my favorite English muffins. It's gonna pack of turkey bacon. I fry some eggs and then I like to get this cheese to put on top because it melts really nice. Um, and everybody in the whole family, including Jagger, who's kind of picky, will eat it. And I want to cook pretty quick today, so I've actually got bacon going in two pans. <laughs> Just so I can like get it done as fast as possible. I was almost done getting ready and then I smelled bacon, so I had to come right <laughs> down. So I, we're making sandwiches? Yeah. What's so shaking, I bacon? Have, like, breakfast sandwiches for lunch. Yeah. It's cooking, it's almost done, and then I'm That's gonna start really making good. eggs. He found the breadsticks and sauce. Oh last night. yes. Little Italian boy. <laughs> He's dipping it on the outside of the glass. He well. Oh, what do you got? You want to take that off? Oh, he has a little pepper or something on there. Okay. He found a little herb and he was like, no. <laughs> Thank you. Please take that off. How is it? It's really good. He doesn't like the fried edges of eggs. He wants the middle, right? The texture. Yeah. He likes the egg. He likes the bread and cheese, but. He is he picky. Like he has bread. been picky lately, but yeah. I guess that's just the age because you're two. 
Big reveal, here's our family costume this year. We are Coraline and Company. Coraline and other mother, the cat. And what are these two crazy ones' names? Miriam and <laughs> well, the grandmas. The grandmas. That live in the, below the house. The Bel basement apartment. Yeah. The basement, and then YB, and this little ghost, Jagger's, you know, He's too, he's a little bit, uh, he got up early from a nap, so he's a little crabby, but he's ready for some candy. And I'm other father, I don't have my glasses on right now. Um, but yeah, that's it, Coraline, looking good. I think that's a great costume. Good job, guys, you look awesome. We're doing a trunk or treat, so we're gonna be going to, I think like 100 cars or something like that. And what are you gonna say, Jagger? Trick or treat. Trick or treat, that's right, very good. So yeah, we're gonna see a bunch of decorated cars right now. I'm really excited. There's always people that do a really good job at this. The cars are like super themed and super fun. Coraline, you gotta stay with me so people know who I am. Otherwise, I'm just like a guy in a robe. <laughs> right, YB? <laughs> it is a little windy, but your guys' costumes look great. We'll also have to keep adjusting wigs a little. Gretchen yourself. <laughs> so we just got a map, and yeah. the wind is not helping Dad's hair at all. Hey, it look, looks good, I think. Oh, I, I can still tell who you are. <laughs> I think Grayson's costume is one of my favorites this year. We've been working on this idea, this costume theme, since like July. The feather hat is what does it for me. I really think the hat really, really did it right. And then Gemma, look at this. So her little cast, um, her splint fit into her costume just fine. We were worried for a minute, but it worked out, huh? Yeah. Are you excited? Yeah, she's wearing it with new glasses. I know, she's still getting used to them because it's been like less than a day since she's had them. Yes. They look really good. You look so cute. I've had like four people ask me if I was Ron Burgundy. I think it's like the robe and stuff, and maybe the hair. I don't know. A lot of people. Looks like there's a, the ambulance has some stuff over there. Got the pumpkin man there. Porta potties. Here we go. Now we're getting down. There's huge winds right now. They were saying, they're saying it's like 30 mile an hour winds. So. Trying to keep it together. Look at this. Look at all these pops they got here. They got a whole army. Loki for president. Loki army. 24. We're for it. I'm here for it. There you go. Oh, good one, Gemma. She's not left handed. <laughs> got the Elvis crew. Here, I'll take your helmet. Or no, you good? There you go. Hey, look at that. You win the car. No. <laughs> it's a happy birthday trick or treat spot. That's great. What do you think of that? Trick or treat? <laughs> happy birthday. <laughs> yeah, nice. She's not left handed. <laughs> she broke her other one. Oh, wow. Good job. Maybe she is left handed. Do you want to throw a snowball? Can to give it a try, Gretchen? Yeah? Coraline? Oh, there we go. Hey, good job. I'd like uh, lobster with some butter. What do we got? Oh, candy. That's our special on Sunday. Okay. That's great. so cute. Jagger, what's this one over here? How's it going, guys? Thank you. This is Halloween. You see that? This is Halloween, this is Halloween. What do you say? Trick or treat? That's his favorite movie, Nightmare Before Christmas. Mine too, mine too. <laughs> oh, here's some pirates. Jagger's just rolling through, He's just sitting collecting there, chocolate. Candy in his He's like, trick or treat, trick or treat. <laughs> he loves this. Oh, what do we got? 100 acre wood over here? There we go. Wait, Look at this. this wow. Gummy bears or Starburst? Okay. Here you go. I gotcha. Here you go. Trick or treat, buddy. How many things has he opened so far? He's eating, He's eating all the gummies. Oh, good. Okay. Good boy. He loves gummies. Trick or treat, please. There you go. Put it in your basket. Trick or treat. Good one. Thank you. There's a baby in there. Believe me. Is you? He's holding you in there? Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> that was a spoiler alert. Hugh Hefner. 
cool. You're a villain in your own right. <laughs> hey, so it's Coraline. Oh, it's you ever seen the movie oh, Coraline? Coraline. Oh, dad, here, wait, 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 wait. People also been saying uh, Ron Burgundy. Here, I put these put these glasses on. All right, that's better. Got to yeah. I got to keep the glasses on. Yeah. <laughs> He's accepted all of the. Are you, right. Whatever you want to call me. Whatever you want to call me, Batman. Jagger, do you see it? Oh, Oogie Boogie. Boogie. Nightmare Before Christmas. So it's still pretty windy, but I think the kids are having a lot of fun. It's not as cold now that we're like walking Moving around. Moving around a bit. for sure. The funniest thing is like, unless we're all together, people are not really understanding what we are. Jeff and I had to take our glasses off because it's like getting dark and we can't see very well through them. Batman thought I was Hugh Hefner. Oh, uh, yeah. He's like, he's like, all right, you're Hugh a legend. Hefner taking his kids to a legend, no big deal. Um, and then Graceland and Gabrielle's costumes make sense, but only if they're standing right next to yeah. each other. Yeah. Otherwise, you're like. What are they doing here? Two crazy ladies from retirement home that escaped for Halloween. Yeah, they look great though. Jagger's doing great. He's eating every gummy candy that he's been Exists. handed so far. Yeah. Reese's. Wow, Reese's, awesome. Sure. Whoa. Sick haul. Oh, we got McDonald's. Yeah, they didn't get that at the Chuck or Treat. We had it DoorDash and it arrived. The same time we arrived it's home, perfect so perfect timing. Perfect timing. Good yeah. haul. Good haul for one hand. Imagine what you could have got with two hands. <laughs> Pretty good, Smarties. She loves that. That's good. You got a haul over there. Oh, I gotta come see over here. All right, Gracie. Got some good stuff. Peanut butter and chocolate. No, don't see much over here, but I can always rely on no Coraline. Got some pieces of Reese's. That's good. Yeah, that's Looks good. Nice. What? I wonder why is this one smaller than that one? Oh, <laughs> somebody maybe had a couple. It was a trick. Did you say trick or treat? That's what a trick looks like. <laughs> <laughs> That's gonna do it, guys. Let us know in the comments below what you're gonna be for Halloween, and we'll see you soon.